Benny Hill. Now to the side of Catfish Lake, there lives a big guy known as Jake. Why, he's a tough, he leaves the shells on when he swallows clams. Why, he's a hard and mean and cruel, he darns his socks with steel wool. And so stupid, he thinks it comes from hydraulic ranch. <laughs> he's got a neighbor called Leroy, and he sure does hate this boy, because he's a smart ass. He's got a quick brain in his head. Why, he could sell a new disclose, or ice cream to Eskimos. I reckon he could even sell the Pope a double bed. <laughs> Boston and Jean, when young Leroy ambles in, says ain't been this year place since I was a kid. I see they've done up the saloon, but I sure do miss that old spittoon. And Jake looks up and says, boy, you always did. There's a cup of blue in El Paso. Tell me soon there's gonna be a showdown. Tell me soon there's gonna be a showdown. Men, forget your guns and lessons. And when it's all, get out of town. Such a last last week I was in his house, he entertained me royally. I had quite a groove. And by the side of my plate of ham, I seen a napkin with a monogram. Well, I thought it was until I saw it move. <laughs> now, I ain't gonna say he's mean, but outside his house I seen a man with a bill for five days on the run. Jake says, look, I shoot to kill. Would you swear that was a man with a bill? He said, well, either that or a duck with a Stetson on. <laughs> Jake said, you pushed my grandpa off the roof. He said, you know that ain't the truth. He just slipped into the rain barrel with my cousin Beth. And for hours, Annette and Carol tried to sort of lift him out of the barrel. Well, that old boy was ecstasy to death. Very <laughs> <laughs> soon there's gonna be a showdown. Men forget your guns and lassoes. And women forget out of town. Leroy says you ought to take more care when you go out hunting bear. You shot my prize pig and watched him die. Jake says, to show my heart's real big, I'm gonna replace your pig. He says, okay, you'll find the sow out in the sty. He says, how about Jenny Lark? She claims that one night in the dark, she was raped by your son Joe. She swears it's true. He said, if it was dark, then how did she know that it was my son Joe? He says, because she had to show him what to do. <laughs> Leroy puts down his beer, he says, I'm getting out of here. And he wanders off into the night, so black. Then they see Jake depart, and they know that in their heart, only one of them boys is a coming back. Jake was buried out of town, just six feet underground, and they couldn't pin his murder on a soul, because he was tying up a knot in his shoelace when he was shot, and the sheriff never found the bullet hole. <laughs> This is a real nice peaceful time. <laughs> 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 <laughs>